Hello, Taurus. Welcome to Lorel's Moon. Um. So, this will be for um, December, the beginning parts of December. Um, I will be looking into seeing about you and your partner. What's going on with you, your partner? And possible candidates that could be um, coming your way. First parts of December. So, tell your friends to like and subscribe. I already have a December's overall um, overall posted for all of the signs. Check them out. I must say it's the cards. So, Taurus. Taurus, Taurus. 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 Okay, here we go. So, Taurus. So, it's looking like uh, you could be having a hard time with your family. Overall, bottom of the deck is the star card. So, you could be trying to gain purity over this overall situation or um, clarity over the situation, renewal and within yourself and um, getting your shit together. Definitely see that, Taurus. You be having some family issues. Um, your partner is feeling like um, this is not getting off the ground. Uh, things need to be grounded within the situation. Um, definitely past lover, but you guys could be having communication with cups of love. Um, the reason why I say that is because the six of cups is here. Um, you could be coming out of emotional conflict and you could be gaining cl clarity over overall within yourself and coming and breaking out of these ties that could be holding you back from um, doing something new. Could be a uh, Virgo Taurus Capricorn here, uh, someone who could be moving pretty fast. Um, they could be very stubborn, um, possible land travels a lot. Um, Either you or your partner is going to be taking time to get away, taking time for mental reflection. Um, someone doesn't know whether or not they're happy or sad here, or if they need to um, explore possibilities once they do get away. Um, now, they could be you could be having a hard time getting off your feet, or the person that you're dealing with is having a hard time getting off of their feet or coming up with new ideas. I'm going to clarify as to what's going on with your partner and why they're feeling like this. Um, and then possibly something new. Oh, okay. So they're coming out of a time where they were feeling burdened about a situation. Possibly trapped. Um, it could be, you know, like little disagreements here and there, or it could be you who is reflecting on yourself, trying to get away from the situation to gain uh, purity overall and uh, wanting your consciousness to be cleared of any uh, misunderstandings. Definitely see that, Taurus. Um, you could be, let's see. Yeah, you're coming at a time where you're feeling stabbed in the back. You could have been stabbed in the back by this person. Definitely someone from the past. And with the Ten of Swords here in reverse, uh, you're coming out of an a unjustly period of mental issues. Um, or it could be them because they're feeling like the Four of Wands here in reverse. Their family or something had a shakedown within the family or they're not feeling like this family is... Um, 
worth fighting for, uh, especially with the Ten of Staffs in reverse here. So, Taurus. Yeah, and you're feeling really defeated within the situation, and you're kind of like giving up on the situation. Um, you could be um, feeling like you had to bow down to this person too many times. Um, but you're not, you're taking a stand once you've taken that leap of faith and you leave and, uh, take, uh, left from the situation. Definitely Taurus. Um, so you're going to go out possibly, um, yeah, I would definitely say that you guys are going to be coming out of your shell and getting out. Um, <clears throat> you will be kind of looking at the money that you could have lost or you could you could have felt like you've lost something um, with the five of coins here oh and you're definitely dealing with could be Scorpio or you're feeling like defeated um, like you have to bow down to this person or you could be um, feeling like you're uh, being punished by dealing with this person um, you were coming out of a third party situation possibly or coming to a, a point of having to um, think about yourself and where you stand with this person because you do feel kind of defeated and you're feeling like you need to take a look at your coins so we're gonna see if there is someone possibly new coming in for you Taurus for the beginning part of December. The beginning part of December. Now, Taurus, you could be juggling um, a possible Aries here with the Magician card in reverse. Um, or you could be dealing with a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius that could be coming into play. But you are definitely juggling these two people that will be coming in. So, let's look a little bit further for the week, first week of December. Yeah, you'll be looking at these two people and you'll be uh, trying to see which one you can gain balance with the Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or it could be um, the Aries, or you could be dealing with an Earth sign, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. But you will be gaining renewal once you balance these two things and you will be finding out which one you would choose but they will be coming in yeah definitely Virgo Taurus Capricorn um, <clears throat> some water here as well but you will be juggling um, two different people so you might want to see who's the best candidate for you or um, make sure that this person has the best interest for you okay Thank you for um, tuning in to my channel, and I shall see you next week.